It's now time to decide as election candidates join millions of voters going to the polls in the UK. In his Oxfordshire constituency, David Cameron marked his ballot. He may soon have to move out of the Prime Minister's residence in Downing Street. Hoping to take the keys is the Labour leader, Ed Miliband. But the latest opinion polls put the two parties equal on just above 30%. And if so, they'll need to seek support elsewhere. UKIP under Nigel Farage is now the third largest party, polling around the 12% mark. But the anti-EU leader has a real battle on his hands, as the Tories have made huge gains in the South Thanet constituency he's contesting. Meanwhile, on a high is the SNP leader, Nicola Sturgeon. The Scottish nationalists' projected clean sweep north of the border will likely prove crucial. <laughs> Elsewhere, holding the centre ground is Nick Clegg. The Deputy PM's Liberal Democrats are polling around 12% and he's indicated a willingness to deal with either side to prevent a lurch to the right or left. After a long election campaign, it's set to be one of the closest contests in British history. The results will start coming through at midnight local time, with the votes all counted and verified by Friday afternoon.